Hi guys, thank you for clicking on this video. This is Reggie from SCG Orbro 64. Just wanted to do a quick video of a basic overview of the different uh, menus, options, and modes that are available for Nintendo's new game, new IP, ARMS. So the first thing that we have is Grand Prix. This is basically your campaign mode if you if you like and you can do it either one player or two players you can uh, tackle it uh, together with a friend uh, so it can be either a, like a single player campaign or a co-op now it is very bare bones it doesn't have a lot of story um, it's not voice acted uh, either uh, but it's it's still a good mode it's just a little uh, lacking now versus mode this is the you know your regular multiplayer uh, fun uh, that you can do with, uh, you know, people playing on the same Switch system. So you have one t or two players. Uh, keep in mind, two players split screen is 60 frames per second. Three or four players is 30 frames per second. And there you have your main online mode, which is party match. You see right there it says fight online for fun. So this is not ranked. This is just for you know people just want to have fun and don't want to take it that seriously and just selling Grand Prix you can play either yourself or with another person and then we have ranked match now this is the more uh, the most like the serious mode if you want to be ranked so this is a pretty good I haven't tried it yet uh, keep in mind to unlock ranked matches you do have to play Grand Prix in uh, level 4 or level 5 and up and win the Grand Prix after that is when you you can go ahead and do a ranked match then we have the friends mode basically this is if you wanna play uh, fight online with friends just so I can give you a nice demonstration here so you see here this is my list of friends if they were, if they are like online or playing, it would have that green uh, dot you see there on the beside the name. If they will be uh, joinable, it would say so. There will be like a, a button or an icon on the right side of the name uh, that will say joinable, so you can actually join your friends. Oh, and also another thing that you can do here is like create a lobby, like a private lobby for you and your friends. Now local, this is fight against nearby players, so you with your Switch console can play with another person that has a, a Switch console as well. On the bottom we have these three things that are not that prominent but they could be important. So one of them is help, this is your basic tutorial mode. Uh, you can do here basic controls. You see basic controls, it gives you different options like uh, for thumbs up grip. The Joy-Con grip, handheld mode, Joy-Con sideways, or the Nintendo Switch Pro controller, which is my preferred option of playing. So you can see there the different control methods uh, for this game. Then you have modes and rules. It basically gives you uh, information for you know fight, V ball, which is one of the modes available. The hoops, skill shot which is rather fun, this is actually one of my favorite ones. One on 100, I haven't done this yet. And then you have Party Match, Rank Match, Get Arms, which is the other option we're gonna get to later on. That's where you can actually spend your hard-earned cash to try to get new arms. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and show that off a little bit. Now if you see there, that's what you do, you basically hit a lot of targets you can earn uh, arms at the end okay here we see the different items that are available on the game so that will be it for that let's see tips and tricks it's just that tips and tricks keep in mind this is completely optional you know Nintendo does not on this game does not put you the, the tutorials like front and center I think maybe that it's not the best thing that they could have done because it would have saved me uh, like a lot of time if I could just know uh, how I can play better. 
But the, you know, what I did was just learning while I play it, so that, that's not that bad. So you see here we have the, the fighters, we have Sister Sprint Man, Ribbon Girl, Ninjara, Master Mummy, Min Min, Mechanica, and I think Twin Tail is going, yeah, Twin Tail, that's the other one, and the robot, Bite and Bark, you see later, Police Avasas, and Kid Cobra, and Helix, he's the weirdest of them all, to be honest, it's just like a pile of goo, I don't know, and then we have extra stuff, which is, you know, that you can't press the home button in matches, lobbies, or etc. Yeah, you can, uh, this game you can actually watch a replay of your match, so that's uh, pretty good. So yeah, so that's help. And here we have set arms, that's where you can choose what arms you want available for your fighter. So you have, you know, light, medium, or heavy arms. So this is, uh, these are the ones that I have set at this moment, Megawatt, Toaster, and Tribal. But I can also see the ones that are set for Ribbon Girl, Ninjara, and Master Mummy, and all the characters basically. So if you can see here, I can basically switch between what I have here and the ones that I have here on the left. Now here in Get Arms, just like I said before, this is where you go ahead and play like a little a mode where you have to punch a lot of skill shots so that way you can earn prizes. The prizes are different arms. The arms are, it could be for Mr. Spring Man or it can be for anyone else. So if you use a certain character, it doesn't mean that the arms that you are going to get at the end are going to be for that character only. It's going to be for everyone. It's like randomly generated. So once you select a character, it gives you three options if you want to play with a short timer, a medium timer, or a long timer. That basically lets you know if, you know, you're going to be playing there for a little while, you know, normally, or a long while. So yeah guys, that's basically it for this video. I just wanted to give you guys a quick uh, overview of the different modes that are available for ARMS. This is the new IP from Nintendo, released on June 16th. It's very good, I do uh, recommend this game. So thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and click on like if you haven't already. Go ahead and subscribe to our channel. You can hit the notification bell um, as well, so you can be notified whenever we post a new video or we do a live stream. Keep in mind, we will be making live streams of this and Mario Kart 8 Deluxe during Saturdays and Sundays, so please be on the lookout for that. And thank you very much for watching, guys. Have a great day.